Hello everyone, it is a pleasure to be here and it's a great honor to present the wonders of Vision Blue, a product by the Dork company which is very, very useful helping surgeons, experienced and non-experienced, with difficult cases in cataracts. What are the situations in which Vision Blue can be a great tool to help even an experienced surgeon? All the cataracts without a red reflex, like mature cataracts or even cortical cataracts, cataracts associated with either retinal detachment or vitreous hemorrhage, cases in which the pupil is small or will not dilate, like synechia, pseudosfoliation, floppy iris, also in cases in which you encounter a corneal opacity or a pterygium concomitant with the cataract and that covers partially the vision of the anterior uh, capsule, or especially important in ophthalmologists in training who have some difficulties uh, with the capsulorexis or that in the middle of doing it, it gets lost. The vision blue is very helpful to find the edge of the capsule again. And now I'm going to show you a few examples on how and when to utilize vision blue. The first case shows a regular mature cataract. I'm staining it with vision blue. I'm, I'm injecting vision blue in the anterior chamber to stain the anterior capsule, washing the vision blue with uh, balanced salt solution. Sometimes I inject directly uh, viscoelastic material, but in this case, I prefer to wash it. And then I'm performing a capsulorexis, which with the stain was no trouble at all. The next case shows a traumatic cataract with partial loss of the anterior capsule, as we can perfectly see once we have injected Vision Blue. We complete the anterior rexis with scissors and, uh, and forceps, always remembering that these mature cataracts have weak zonules and it's not convenient at all to pull on them. So, as you can see here, this last part was fibrosed and I completed the capsulorexis with scissors. Once this was achieved, the rest, since it was a traumatic cataract, it was easy to aspirate. This third case shows an advanced but not mature cataract, but as you could see, there was no red reflex and with that it's easily to lose the edge of the capsule and do a less than perfect capsulorexis, anterior capsulorexis. The patient had also pseudoxfoliation, although the pupil in this case uh, dilated quite well, but without, if we had not stained the anterior capsule, it could have been quite difficult to perform successfully this capsulorexis. It's also important to have a product like Vision Blue with a, a, a very a purity standards, high purity standards, because if not, the staining is not going to be even, it's going to get blotchy, and in some cases it's even worse than not having the, the capsule stained at all. In this next video, we see a mature cataract with the sign which is known as the Argentinian flag because of the blue and blue stain with the white stripe in the middle as the Argentinian flag. And even though we had this complication, with the capsule, all the stain, we can easily identificate where the edges of the uh, starting capsulorexis are and completed it without more problems. The Elena Barraquer Foundation, the foundation of which I am president, travels frequently to Africa and Latin America to 
operate cataracts in people who need that type of surgery, otherwise they will be blind. In the last five years, the Elena Barraquer Foundation has operated more than 15,000 cataracts in those continents and most of them it would have been impossible to do them or very hard to do them without Vision Blue. I encourage you to try it, to use it and you won't regret it. Thank you very much for your attention. Thank mm -hmm. you.